In 2017, US President Donald Trump signed a directive instructing NASA to return astronauts back to the moon and eventually reach Mars and beyond. The US Space Agency plans to return to the moon by 2024 and reach Mars in 2033. But according to experts, reaching the red planet by then is highly unlikely considering the massive effort to bring humans to the moon in the first NASA mission back in the 1960s. For them, challenges aren't so much technical or scientific as much as a question of budget and political will. And it's not just budget. Experts say it's also organization bandwidth. How many things can NASA do at the same time? NASA and other agencies are working hard to bring humans closer to the day we finally touch the red planet. A handful of rovers and landers have increased our understanding of the planet's surface, atmosphere and complex geological makeup. International space agencies have simulated the Martian environment so astronauts can learn how to adjust in the planet's harsh environment. Experts around the world have also come up with life-saving tools to survive on Mars. However, according to Julie Robinson, NASA's chief scientist for the International Space Station, the most important task is finding a way to shield astronauts from constant exposure to solar and cosmic radiation. She added that the second problem is our food system, because the current plant system ideas are not packageable, portable or small enough to take to Mars. The mission will also require agencies to produce more developed astronaut suits and new techniques to exploit Martian resources to extract water, oxygen and fuel necessary for humans to live there. Scientists will also need to improve the way astronauts deal with medical emergencies. The whole mission could take two years since Mars and the Earth are closest to each other every 26 months. Another problem is how will a group of people cope with the psychological stress or being totally isolated for two years? A NASA researcher studying the likelihood of getting to Mars by 2033 concluded the object was infeasible. For some experts, the best year to reach Mars might be the year 2060.